At this point, a lot of you are very familiar with our main characters on the channel. I think it's time to gradually introduce you to some of the more prominent people in my life, many of whom you've already heard of. For example, my annoying roommate, my evil sister, butcher shop guy that probably doesn't even work there, my cringe lord friend Isaac, my quant analyst friend, uh, we'll call him Goldman Sachs, and finally the person you're meeting today, the paranoid associate. Paranoid associate, or PA, has even less cooking experience than me. Can you believe it? He moved into his new apartment in Boston recently. I want to check it out and learn some recipes together. Most of the video is going to be real-time audio, no voiceover, so don't be too mean in the comments, please. This glass here will explain later. Pretty functional kitchen over here. Are they dirty? Sort of. Yeah, they are. <laughs> this kind of looks like one of those poor <laughs> cats in couch. <laughs> nice desk. That's never good. Here is uh, his hobbies. Only hobby? Your Christmas decoration? Yes, I, I bought it in the parking lot when I was repairing my car. You bought it in the parking lot? <laughs> yeah, a guy came up to me in Cole's parking lot and goes, would you like to buy this for $35? <laughs> $35 for the parking lot? Yeah. I was scared. Maybe there's drugs in it. This is this is my bed, by the way. That's how I'm treated here. High-tech mattress. How old is this sheet, bro? All right, let's show how the magic happens. All right, which is the sofa mode, and the bed mode, and the split mode, when it just goes in between, like right now. Okay, let's, let's see the bed mode. Okay, here's the bed mode. It's kind of slow. Standing here waiting for us. Coming home with you is already a bad decision. <laughs> what kind of pillows are those? Because you took the normal <laughs> pillow. Why is there one pillow? <laughs> With an oversized sheet. <laughs> you took yeah, well, okay, let me show you. Let's, let's put it back into the split mode. Alright. So if you put it in the split mode, it goes back. Maybe, maybe fast forward this part. But two closets, very neatly organized storage. Neatly. This is my underwear. Uh, we don't, we don't <laughs> see that. This is all the socks. A fried egg. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. Why is it kind of wet? Lamb. <laughs> I was crying for help over there. And dumbbells, which have not been touched ever since I bought them. Fridge tour. Sammy Adams. Some raisin, because you're an old lady. It's a little moldy. What kind of jam is it? Raspberry jam. I look a middle schooler, but why do you have so many pudding snacks? <laughs> not radioactive though. Those are potatoes. You're not supposed to keep potatoes in the fridge. Why not? You keep it outside. Who said that? The National Foundation of Potato Storage Association. Great. This is the best snack ever made. Mango cream bars. Yes. It's like a creamsicle, but mango. Some kuntao chicken. Just Oh yeah, I, I eat uh, ice creams and I leave the carton boxes inside. Why? Because I don't want to go to recycling box. I see. You know, yaso is, uh, in Greek, hello is yasos. So yaso is like, hello yogurt. <clears throat> well. Uh, do you have any cooking equipment? Cooking equipment? Yeah. Not particularly. One plate. One glass that's actually for drinking, the other for that. This is my international section, as I call it. Oh, great. <laughs> Got the Baked beans is international, huh? Uh, it's, I mean, it's British. Baconless bacon. Uh, it's all, it's also empty, by the way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, I got the, look, for baking, I got a glove. It's called glove? It's called a mitten. Yes. I mean, just one? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, use, I use paper towels on the other hand. Oh, I mean, that works. After some discussion, we decided to make a simple lemon cheesecake with the lemon curd on top. The recipe will be in the description. We'll be going to Trader Joe's to get ingredients for the cheesecake and also Target to buy some mixing bowls and stuff. This will be the first time in my life I'm giving out instructions to another person, so wish me luck. 
Are we gonna be okay driving the snow like this? It's gonna be great. You know what's crazy too? I think the passenger airbags don't work. <laughs> what? I haven't seen snow like this in a while. You know it didn't snow at all in New York last year. Same thing in Boston. You know when the last time it was snow like this? When? When we made the igloo in high school. Wait, how long did we spend on that igloo? Over three hours. Three hours on an igloo? Yeah. We that, that's pretty fast. Yeah, well, not bad. Yeah. And remember we crawled into the igloo with towels and started FaceTiming our girlfriends and they thought we were so stupid. <laughs> Nobody finds an impressive boss. Like, neither of those girls are with us anymore. <laughs> Bro, chill. What are Bro, you doing, man? It was late it's yellow. It's snowing. Late yellow. What late yellow? My biggest, one of my biggest goals in life is to do a road trip across all 50 states, getting the best dogs across in all, each state. All 50 states? All 50 states. But some states don't have good donuts. It doesn't matter, we'll find the best one. Alright. And then get the best donut. For should, we, should we turn that into a video series? Uh, sure, it's gonna take like seven months though, probably. You know it's when you get an Uber and like the Uber driver goes, I know a better way. I know a better way. I'm like, please, I'm trying to get to the airport. <laughs> Just follow the GPS, man. I don't care about your 40 years of experience. I see your taste of music is still um, pretty unique. Listen. I got that international music taste. I appreciate the cultures. Man, what bro, is going on? How do people vlog like this? This is the most embarrassing. Thing. Let's put it on the cart. Maybe it'll be a little more subtle. Bro, it's gonna fall. Mm. Oh, actually, no, it's perfect. Put it there. All right. All right. Uh, are you done, bro? What are you trying to get? I'm trying to have a face wash, man. You think? Just get whatever. Bro, you think this beauty is natural? You need to keep it up, you know. What beauty, man? Hold on, I'm I'm getting. <laughs> I want you to hold the camera longer so everybody <laughs> sees you. <laughs> so everybody sees you in best. <laughs> That's fine. Two blocks of the original. Oh, a third less fat. No, no, get the full fat. Get the full two. Full fat. Yeah, full just fat. Just like us. Walking around in the grocery store. Do you need more eggs? Nine inch. So we can just make the batter and be done with it. Huh. What should we make? Get it? Should we make our own? Nah, I don't want to get a kick pan. Let's just get this. All right. And we'll just tell the viewers that we made it off camera. <laughs> Look. Do you want to just buy a cheesecake and cancel the video? <laughs> you see, this one's 10 bucks. I'll go for the cheapest one. All right. Cheapest one would be okay, this one. Okay, maybe not bad. <laughs> Imitation vanilla. That sounds scary. Who buys, uh, who buys a hazelnut spread over Nutella? Uh, I do. No. It's a lot cheaper, man. Nutella's overpriced. Inflation's real, dude. Couldn't make it to 100. Our first step is to preheat the oven to 350. You should probably take this stuff out first. Wait. Where's the other block? Or did we just get one block? I got one block. We didn't get two blocks? We got one block. I said two full fat blocks. Yeah, I thought you were talking about us. Like blocks, like, you know, like gentlemen, like lads. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have trash. Hmm? I don't have trash. You don't have a trash can? No. Why didn't we get one at Target? Too expensive. It's not worth it. Uh, uh, Alright, uh, we'll just leave it here to come to room temperature while you get the other block. There's another block there! No, that's the one I threw here after I took it out. Oh, man. <laughs> why, why didn't you throw that in the trash? It's recycling. Okay, put that in the recycling. I don't have recycling. <laughs> so is one block of cream cheese to a third of a cup of sugar. Yes. I already did one block and a third, so why don't you do the second one? All you want to do is just to mix it. It's kind of hard. It is, because we just got it. It's supposed to come up to room temperature. Too real? Uh, we could. Or, we can, we can mean, microwave it. Huh? We can microwave it. You want to microwave it? Yeah. Can we? Yeah, we yeah. It said microwave, uh... Safe? Safe, yeah. Do people ever microwave cream cheese for a cheesecake? Listen, if they don't, they're mistaken. Alright, let's microwave it then. I didn't know cooking with you would be so frustrating. <laughs> it's fun! Now, now I kind of understand how my audience feels when they watch me cook. Oh, by the way, do you have a zester? Yes. Oh, nice. Mamba. I assume you don't have a juicer, right? Try not to get any pit, but it's fine if you do. Bread pit? <laughs> one, one at a time. Crack it on the flat surface. Wow. Look at that. 
All right, just whisk that in. Oh. You don't have to hold the other egg while whisking. Oh. <laughs> just two guys in the kitchen having fun. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> oh. Let's just get this over with. I'm regretting this decision. You didn't even get the side. Wait. Oh, this stuff? Yeah, take the spatula and get all that stuff down. Mm -hmm. All right. Bro, come on, man. <laughs> Just do this. Wait, hold, hold the light. The spatula is designed for you to like catch all the sides like that. Make sure you get the bottom too. You're only whisking in very like restrained motion. <sighs> Why are you silent like that? Nothing. Just, I'm just... I'm getting a feeling you're not enjoying it as much as I am. I'm just impressed by the variety of life that people have. What? <laughs> what are you saying? You gotta put your heart in it. You don't have to shake your ass. Why are you doing that? <laughs> Just move your forearm. Two teaspoons. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah. Quarter of a cup of heavy cream over here. Yep. It's really thick. Yeah, you got it. Just, just, just o open the sides. Yeah, good job. Has your mom ever tried to teach you how to cook? Yeah. How did that go? Did she, like, did she beat you afterwards? Yeah, but it wasn't because of cooking. You can tilt the angle more if you want. Hmm? Done? Uh, you gonna throw that away in the bowl? Oh, we're gonna fill the full thing? Yeah, what oh. are you gonna keep that for? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like you don't have common sense. <laughs> what have you ever watched a cooking video? No. Oh, do you watch my videos? Uh, when need arises. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> yeah, put it in the center. Is it gonna fit? Oof. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine, and then pour the boiling water from the side. Produce a lot of steam to protect the surface from cracking. But your oven temperature is on gentle bake, so no convection should be better too. What do we have? Actually, that's enough. Try to put it in the middle rack. Yeah, good job. Set a timer for 45 minutes. Once the time is up, we'll put a loose foil on top to prevent any more browning, and we'll wait another 25 minutes. So yeah. in a total of 70 minutes. That wasn't too bad. Yeah. You know, one I call it, it was a piece of cake. Oh. <laughs> It's like kind of jiggly, so it's almost done. Well, ideally, we're gonna cover it with tin foil and let it bake for 25 minutes. We don't have any, so we're just gonna put it right back for 25 more minutes. Sounds good to me. So why did we take it out? That's what I was gonna ask you. <laughs> do you even know what you're doing, bro? Trust me, bro. To prevent the top getting a little browned up like that. We'll let it rest in the water bath for maybe an hour or so. Come back, put it in the fridge, and rest it for six hours. You never know when you might need it. Look at that. All right, uh, why don't you take that jam and spread it on top? Let's put it on this plate. <laughs> Look at that, bro. Look at this beauty. Yeah, that's actually looking really nice. A thin of a beauty. Yeah, do a little more. And that's it. That's it, that's it. It's Ooh. still looking pretty good. <laughs> bro. Did you actually learn the recipe? Can you of make course. it like, can you make Bro, it by yourself now? My eyes closed. You know what? I can make it so easy, it's gonna be a piece of cake. Bro, you gotta chill with that. <laughs> Bro, this is thick Bro, over this here. Is art. Like, Shut up, man. Over there. What do you know? <laughs> this is art. Bro, like this. Bro, shut up, man. Here. There's nothing Shut's over up. there. Nice. 
Your first cheesecake. Bro. Let's pour this on the... That's your piece? Yeah. I get the small piece? Yeah. You have two plates? <laughs> yeah. Looking pretty good. All right, let's go. Why don't you go first, since you made it? You like it? <laughs> Squeeze it. I can't believe we made it. It's a lemon pit. <laughs> Why am I getting all this? Bro, I'm good. I'm good. What are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. Are you on drugs? <laughs> Why do you keep getting this? We don't need to make eye contact, man. We can just talk about the flavors and stuff. But this is so good. It's very good. How long do you think it's gonna last in your fridge? I don't know. Probably an hour or two. It is a pretty small cheesecake. Yeah. I think if I want it, I can finish the whole thing. You want to bet? I'll pay you 50. You finish that whole cake tonight. Too full. A hundred. A hundred? If you finish it tonight. You know what's the best way to finish this off? What? With the junior mint. Dude, did you eat them all over the fuck? Yeah, I was bored. <laughs> Where the fuck is the rest? There's supposed to be like 40 in here. Yeah. Bro, how are you finding all those bits, man? Why am I getting all the bits? I didn't get a single one. <laughs> I think you swallowed them, bro. <laughs> I think you don't chew your food. Did your parents, when you were a kid, tell you that if you swallow a pit, like a plant's gonna grow inside of you? No, I thought that and my parents debunked it. No, no, my parents told me that. When I was little, I believed that brown cows made chocolate. I feel like you gotta, you gotta have some tea after this. Yeah. It's so fucking heavy. How about Earl Grey? Earl Grey black tea? <laughs> you want? For your insane. <laughs> uh, you're going insane. You want a cup of tea or what? Um, sure. Do you want a marshmallow strawberry? Um, bald and white hair. How you, oh, how you no, bald no. and with white hair? Oh, that? yeah. <laughs> Are you insane? <laughs> no, uh, the center bald, the Mediterranean basin. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a good way to describe it. <laughs> All right, uh, look at that volume jump. <laughs> okay, uh, so he was wearing this golden neck chain. Story time. Me and my roommate uh, went out to a Fenway game. The other one still got the uh, $15 student tickets. Okay. And... There's two guys in front of us. So, okay, I didn't like baseball at all. But, first of all, the hot dogs and pretzels are amazing. Uh, even though they cost 20 bucks. But the best thing is sitting in the cheap seat and people watch. See what people are doing. Mm -hmm. We got the most amazing experience. I didn't want to leave because I was having so much fun. There was two guys sitting in front of us. And two girls next to them. And the whole time, this guy was trying to raise up this girl next to him. Like, Riz up by being loud and obnoxious? Or yes. actually going up to them and no, introducing no. So them? So he started with being loud and obnoxious. He started yeah. screaming things. You know, like We're sitting so far away from the baseball. You can barely see the players. And he's screaming at the players or something. Like, there's no way I can hear anything. Oh, God. But, you know, like well, he's still screaming at them or something. Yeah. And then out of nowhere, he starts talking to her. He's like, so wh where are you guys from? Or whatever. So oh. I'm, like, I'm like, okay, this is amazing. I'm going to be listening to this right now. This is right in front of me, right? And he goes, so where are you guys from? And they're like, oh, where to go to college, whatever. The guy goes, the guy goes, you go to college? Well, you know, me and my buddy dropped out of college here. Because uh, it was a waste of time. You know what we do? We we'll sell cars. We're car salesmen. Okay, that's cool. Like, you don't have to tell people who go to college that's a waste of time. But okay, that's fine. Yeah. Like, I, I think he goes like, yeah, we work in Volkswagen dealership. We sell cars. You know what commission is? Our commission is insane. We make so much money. We're only 19 and we make so much money. Same age. Same age, yeah. Okay. Well, they start telling them, like, yeah, I make so much money. It's crazy. You don't know how much money I'm making. I'm like, I'm sitting there, I'm listening to this, I'm like, was this guy insane? What kind of conversation is this? And then, so, during the break or whatever, he leaves to grab beer or whatever, comes back with that gold chain oh, on no. his neck. He sits down and he goes, I just bought this gold chain, 50 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> 
some useful information you yeah, just dropped. Back. And then, so they keep talking, right? And then, okay, here's like, the funniest part is coming, bro. Right? They're like, they're chatting, whatever. Mm-hmm. And then he goes out of nowhere. You know what else we get at the work other than a lot of commission? We get 401k. Let me show you my 401k. <laughs> he pulls up his he fidelity. Pulls up his... He pulls up his fidelity and starts showing her his 401k to this girl. Well, what what's the return like? I I don't know, <laughs> <laughs> but he's not showing his four one k bro, and this girl's like looking at you like, oh, cool, cool, right? And then he, I'm not even kidding you, so he turns what his body, he he's turning his body. I can hear everything, all four people. Okay. He's turning his body, he's like, oh, this is going good, this is going good, like whatever, right? His thing is going great. What? Yeah, oh, yeah. Can the girls hear him? Uh, I mean, I could hear them, so probably. Oh, okay, okay. And then, um. And then uh, the girl turns to her friend and she goes, uh, I think this guy likes me. And she goes, oh. and she goes, she goes the, her friend goes, which one? And he goes, like, oh, the ugly one. Uh, oh, like, oh, my God. God. <laughs> <laughs> That's so rough. I was like, man, it's insane how they sit next to each other. And they're having completely different reactions to the same conversation. This guy thinks he's doing amazing and this girl thinks he's like insane. Man. <laughs> 